Before I begin the video, I have a few things I'd like to say. I plan on doing a rival reveal, so to speak, where I show myself and have an opportunity to connect to you guys as a more personal creator. I'm also working on a few long league-based documentaries coming within the next couple of weeks or so, which I thought I should announce here as well. And lastly, let me know if you like the captions in the videos or not. It's extra work for me to put them in, but I know some people really appreciate them, especially the hearing impaired. A comment surrounding these things would be great. Oh, and if you aren't subscribed, make sure to double check so that you don't miss out on all these new formats of content I have coming soon. Now onto the video. On Reddit today, I read Meddler responding to the Reddit post that was based around the video they released yesterday that I covered. Again, this was pretty refreshing stuff to read as he was apologetic, sincere, and transparent in his replies to the comments on the post. Firstly, we have this from Meddler. He responds to this user saying that 2023 should have more content than 2022. A promising start, as 2022 was probably the most lean year of League I've seen in a long time. In the same thread, Meddler responds to Spider Axe. The main thing to take away from this one is he says, we'll be particularly focused on as well is having new thematics for biggest events, Worlds, MSI, Summer, etc. Rather than going back to established ones like Project, Star Guardian, etc. again. Another promising response. Next, Meddler responds to the post directly and says they covered the disappointing reception to the cinematic first because it was part of the catalyst for Riot to reevaluate their approach to this season. A wake up call, if you will. Directly under this, a user asks if the cinematic was champion led originally or not. Meddler then goes on to say it was planned, scripted, and in development, but he can't reveal why it ended up unfinished. He also says that Aatrox was indeed meant to be one of the main champions in this year's cinematic based off the appearance of the Aatrox Ward. Below this, he then says that the 2024 cinematic will be essentially what the 2023 one was meant to be, but with more ties to themes they have in mind. He does disclose that they could still go in another direction, however. Another user shares their concerns around the LCS controversy, to which Meddler replies that Riot will have thoughts being shared later next week. One of the last pieces of information I thought would have been handy for my audience to know is that they will be sharing more about the lore side of things soon as well. Anyway, that's about all Meddler had to say in response to the community. Again, I did find his answers helpful and refreshing and I look forward to seeing if Riot can hold their promises. It's make or break for Riot to gain the community's trust back. What are your thoughts on the issue? Let me know in the comments below and for more League news, click the video on your screen. Bye!